if you want to hear want to hear an inspiring word that will get you through your day if you want to build your faith your faith grow in god's grace, god's grace. To have a better connection with jesus christ so tune in to good god's morning good god's morning good god's morning Good guys, morning, everybody. I pray that all is well with you on this Monday morning. For, beloved, it is another day that the Lord has made, and we will, we shall. Come on, say it with me. We're going to rejoice and be glad in it. Good guys, morning, everybody. Good morning, everybody. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Good morning, First Lady. Good morning, Minister Little. And good morning to the rest of you that are on that I can't see. When you come on, say hello to me so I can say hello to you back, all right? I don't want to be rude. So just come on and say hello, good morning, or hi, or something, okay? Again, good guys, morning to all of you all. Today is to Monday. <laughs> Today is Monday, another day the Lord has made. And we're going to rejoice and be glad in it. Let us get our scripture for this morning is coming from James, James chapter 3, verse 18, NIV version, James chapter 3, verse 18. Good morning, Kanita. Good morning, Shelly. James chapter 3, verse 18, it says, the Peacemakers, peacemakers who sow in peace, raise a harvest of righteousness. Peacemakers who sow in peace raise a harvest of righteousness well peacemakers 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 good morning um leslie good morning good morning good morning good guys morning to you good morning um peacemakers Peacemakers, peacemakers who sow in peace, raise a harvest of righteousness. Listen, there is a standard that I believe God has for the people of God. Good morning, Victoria. Um, I don't believe that we as the people of God uh, ought to be hell raisers. Why? Why do I say that? Why do we, what's going on? Well, if we are children of God, if we are his people, if we are his students, you know, we are continuously studying, continuously learning of God. People look at us, people watch us. And if people are watching us and we say that we are the students of God, the children of God, and they see something that doesn't re resemble our teacher, what do you think their opinion is either of us or the teacher. Give an example. Hmm? Give an example. Oftentimes, we could just look at something that someone and tell where they where they stand. Hmm? Yeah, um, you know. We, we're talking about spiritual gifts and how if you have spiritual, the, the Holy Ghost, the, 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 the Holy Ghost gives you spiritual gifts. However, 
not everybody has spiritual all or even you know some spiritual gifts but everybody possesses the fruits of the spirit well what are the fruits of the spirit fruits of the spirit one of those is peace love joy peace happiness how can we say we are children of god his students that we possess the holy ghost if we are hell raisers the peacemaker who souls in peace the one who is 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 there and and who sees chaos and says no well, wait a minute wait a minute come on come on y'all let's 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 get this together let's resolve this this let's bring peace let's you know let's come on come on we are we are we are brothers and sisters in Christ you know we are and I can I keep saying brothers and sisters in Christ or you know um, because most time <laughs> chaos and hell breaks out within the body of Christ why because we all want our agenda we forget who our teacher is and we want to do what we want to do. Scripture says the peacemaker who sows in peace. Come together. Come on, y'all. This raises a harvest of righteousness. What does that mean? Well, the peacemaker who sows in peace, who comes and brings peace, who comes and says, hey, hey, y'all, look. Let's stop. Let's stop all that. Let's, you know, it ain't, it ain't even worth that. You know what I'm saying? Hold on, wait, chill out. You know, let's think about, you know, what we fighting for. What, what's the problem? Let's, let's reason. Come together. Let's, let's reason. Let's compromise. Let's, let's come to an agreement. They raise a harvest of righteousness. They raise the awareness of what it means. To be like and walk like Christ. I don't know. I've never seen any, in any way. Uh, the Bibles of the story. The stories in the Bible where God, Jesus, you know, went around and raising hell. I know he got mad. And overturned the table because they were making the house of God, you know, a, a house of you know, gambling and selling and, you know, it, it was it was being changed from its original intent. I know he did that, and I don't blame him. But any other other time, I don't see any stories where he went around and just was raising hell. He went around and, 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 and invoked peace. I don't know about y'all, but I don't like to be around hell raisers. I just don't. If you're always quarreling, always fighting, I ain't gonna be around you. Because that tells me there is no peace residing on the inside of you. Because peace comes from within. The harvest that we'll see is of making a, 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 a example of Christ. Peace comes from within. And if you are toiling within yourself, you're going to be toiling with everything, everybody around you. Peacemakers who sow in peace raise a harvest. They grow a harvest of righteousness. You raise the standard of what it is to be Christ-like. Now, are you going to get some accolades for that? Probably not. Let's just be honest. Many people like chaos versus they like peace. People like to see mess versus they like to see harmony and peace. It's just people. People. But, love it, you keep on sowing 
in peace. There's a harvest for you that no one can take away from you. Keep on showing, sowing peace. Somebody needs to see what it is to be a real child of God, a real student of God. Keep sowing in peace. Your labor is not in vain. Up the road, there is a reward. You may not see it here, but there is a reward for the peacemaker. The Bible says, blessed are the peacemaker, for they shall inherit the kingdom of God. God don't want no hell raisers in heaven. Come on, I sure don't want to live in hell down here and then go to heaven and then you there too, raising hell too. Come on, I think not. <laughs> if I don't want to deal with you here, what make you think I want to deal with you there? Come on. Praise God. All right, beloved, let's pray. Father, we thank you today for your word. That remind us, the peacemaker who sows in peace there is a harvest of righteousness for them. Father, we thank you for the standard. We thank you for the life that you lived that showed us, gave us an example of how to live this life, how to walk this life, how to get along with our brothers and sisters, and God, how to, to make peace, bring peace. We are the peacemaker. Peace lies within us. And we thank you, O oh God, for giving us peace that surpasses all our understanding. God, we ask you to touch each and every individual that's on this line this morning that will be on and may have already been on. Father, we thank you, O oh God, for the opportunity to commune and fellowship with our fellow brothers and sisters and you. God, help us to continue to remember to be the peacemaker, to be the example. You have set the example. You've showed us the example. Now our job is to follow after our teacher. And we thank you. We give you praise, glory, and honor for it. Bless us now as we endeavor to do your will. It's in Jesus' name we pray. Amen and amen. Good God's morning. Hey, Pastor Jones. Good God's morning to tell you. Good God's morning, everybody. Good God's morning to tell you. Listen, y'all say good morning to First Lady. Good morning, First Lady. Good morning, Sister Perry. Morning, Kanina. Good morning, Shelly. Good morning, uh, Phyllis Leslie. Good morning to you. Good morning, Brandy Thompson. Good morning, Michelle Satcher. Good morning, Victoria. Good morning, Minister Little. Good morning. Good God's good morning to you. Good God's morning. Good God's morning to all of you. All right. Good God's morning to all of you. Y'all have a great day. This is Monday. And uh, we'll see y'all tomorrow, same time, same place, for another Good God's morning moment. Again, go, go, go sow peace. All right. Go sow peace. Go sow peace. There is a harvest for you. Go sow peace. Show people how to walk, live in peace. Remember, peace comes from, from inside. So, make sure you're at peace. <laughs> Leslie, well, thank you so much. To God be the glory. Amen. All right. Well, good God's morning, everybody. Y'all have a great day. We'll see y'all tomorrow, same time, same place. For another good God's morning moment. Good God's morning to you. We'll see y'all tomorrow. If you want to hear want to an hear. inspiring word that will get you through your day. If you want to build your faith, your faith. grow in God's grace. God's grace. To have a better connection with Jesus Christ. So tune in to Good God's morning. Good God's morning, good God.